I'm Dr. Rishma Dhillan Pai. Today, we are going to be speaking on exercise in pregnancy. All of you agree that pregnancy is a great time to initiate good health habits, and exercise is obviously one of them. It helps you keep active, mentally fit, and energetic. Especially in early pregnancy, exercise helps to reduce morning sickness, the nausea, and actually improves appetite. It also helps with getting a good night's sleep and even avoiding constipation. If you exercise all through pregnancy, the chances of getting pregnancy-related blood pressure and diabetes reduce considerably. Of course, there are many myths and misconceptions surrounding exercise and pregnancy, but one thing I definitely want to clarify is that exercise does not cause miscarriage. So don't be scared of that. So our advice to you is definitely do exercise in pregnancy, preferably low impact exercises, maybe 20 to 30 minutes per day. You can walk, you can do yoga, swimming, some light muscle toning exercises. All of these are safe in pregnancy. If you already are doing strenuous exercise or you're a runner, you can continue to do so if you keep well throughout your pregnancy. And remember always, when you exercise, stay hydrated. Wear comfortable clothes, wear good, well-fitted shoes, because in pregnancy, because of swelling and edema, your shoe size may change. Also, make sure you avoid very strenuous exercises, avoid sprinting, contact sports, and exercises that cause a lot of stress on the torso and on the pelvis. So the important thing is really to listen to your body. If you're feeling tired, if you're feeling breathless, it's time to stop and to take a break. So very rarely really will a doctor advise you to stop or avoid exercise. And that's only if you have, for example, bleeding in pregnancy, or you have pain, or you've had miscarriages, etc. in the past. In all other circumstances, you can very safely exercise throughout your pregnancy.